Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. No, go ahead. Uh, challenge me. Is there a, a word that you think... All right. Cantankerous? Can... Tang... Oh, I didn't even have to type in the whole thing. It was uh, the number one result as I typed in can tan. All right, uh, let's uh, tap through in the new Oxford American Dictionary and get the uh, definition of the word. Bad-tempered, argumentative, and uncooperative, also known as Chris Perillo. No, dude, how'd they get my photo in there? I'm just kidding. There's no illustrations in the dictionary, at least at this point in time. But I can learn how to say the word. Cantankerous. 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 I wonder if you have to sound that way when you actually say it. You know what they should have? They should have had an angry guy record his... Cantankerous. That's what should, they should have gotten John C. Dvorak to do that one. You know what I'm saying? You want to talk about someone who defines cantankerous. Anyway, there's 250 thousand definitions in the new Oxford American Dictionary, and they can be on your iPod Touch or your iPhone. It's available right now for $20 in the iTunes App Store. And uh, what's nice about it is that you don't need an internet connection. So if you are ever away from an internet connection, either 3G, um, you know, let's say Edge or Wi-Fi, but you needed to look up a word, this is the way you're going to want to do it. Uh, the nice thing beyond, you know, just having audio samples for 60,000 words as well as 250,000 words without having access to those things without having to get online, uh, those things. Gosh, I've got a dictionary in my hand. I couldn't think of a better word for word. <clears throat> the nice thing is that, uh, you know, you could have purchased uh, a separate device uh, that had a database of definitions. I certainly remember having a pocket dictionary. Not, not like pages, but an actual electronic pocket dictionary when I was growing up, and uh, this has uh, completely uh, just blown it away. I mean, not only because I have my phone with me wherever I go, uh, but certainly knowing that uh, they will continually update uh, the definitions and add words, I'd assume, in uh, the app, uh, you know, for $20 to have a dictionary in your pocket that you can access anywhere, I mean, so long as you have your phone, I think it's a pretty good bargain. Consider the electronic dictionary or printed dictionary that you're replacing. It's fast, it's easy, and it's accessible right now. So I've got to thank the fine folks at Handmark for allowing me to review this app. I wanted to pass it along uh, to you in case you were thinking about getting someone a pocket dictionary. If they had an iPhone or an iPod Touch, think about getting them the app instead. Might as well, one less thing to carry around. I remember my first dictionary. I still have it, as a matter of fact. It was uh, it was printed. It was small. I mean, not, not much in it. But uh, I remember flipping through and and reading words. I did. I was a, I was a geek even even back then, and I still couldn't think of a better word for word. Or I I, I, I you know I said things when I meant words, because of course that's that's what's in a dictionary is words. My email address is chris at perillo.com. Maybe you feel like passing me a, a word or two. You're more than welcome to. Of course, you're also welcome to join us in our community of geeks, and you can throw your words into there. And of course, you can also upload photos and videos and do a variety of other things, interacting with fellow geeks from around the world. Or Galaxy. I think we've got one Martian geek, or at least that's what he claims to be. He <laughs> can't tell anymore with all these newfangled social networks. <laughs> <clears throat> and you're also welcome to join us in our chat room, which is uh, done in conjunction with this live video feed, because, of course, we're recording and streaming this live right now, as we do 24 hours a day, seven days a week, at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.